Watch this. Muldan versus Gera. Warrior. Hey, this is the guy that uh, this guy did really well at a dream hack or some or like an HCT event, I think. I think he also streams. Um, keep the void color for sure. I kind of want want to keep the doomsayer in case it's a uh, pirate instead of odd warrior. I think we mulligan for pirate because we have such a good matchup against odd warrior. This is looking like a good hand for uh, pirates and. Sure, we just uh we just have a reasonably good matchup here. It's also a good hand for Odd Warrior to be honest, because if we can get an early Malganus behind a bunch of cubes, we're looking good. Typically they don't run owl either, so I can just like shove stuff into cubes and uh that blocks brawls. I think I keep the coin and just tap. There's a cube. Oof. I think we set up a Doomsayer into the uh, the Void Caller. And look to start uh, hitting him for like a billion every turn. We've just got layers upon layers of threats here. It's kind of a bummer draw. I could break this myself, but then it leaves my uh, my Malganus kind of stranded, so... That's always happening. Question is, now what? I think we just sit. But also just throw I could tap and throw away the uh, the defile. Light the fuses. Oh yikes, that's uh ah oh, unfortunate that we got that one. Shield slam is fine. I'm kind of glad that the uh, the Malganus didn't come out of that now, since it would have just died anyway, so. You can save the coin for Nazoth and bring back uh, Void Colors, or at least one Void Color right now, and that will be uh, that'll be pretty good. Um, it'll also bring back this uh, Sylvanas. Don't really think that's relevant. I just want to get these um, these big boy demons into play. Tap and spell stun something. It's a good pickup once I start cubing my uh, big demons. I think I just want to push face. Strip off this armor. I don't really want to steal his stuff, so like copying the the Sylvanas doesn't seem worthwhile. I want to get as many uh, Doom Guards and Malgani as possible. So this goes there. There's a Void Color. That's pretty good. I could kill it this turn. But I don't have any copy things that I get done with that, so I'm just going to hang out. Coin out one of my 10 drops next turn, most likely. Doom guard, sure. Maybe I don't actually coin out a... Uh... We'll see what happens to this Doom guard. There's nothing is happening to this Doom guard, so that's good news.
Yeah, uh, this makes our Gul'dan much better. We can copy another one next turn. I just want to uh, increase the uh, the charge pool for my Gul'dan so that I can burst for a lot. I've already got that one Void Lord in. I probably don't want the second one in that pool at all, and I don't really want the Nazoth because of the uh, the number of um, Void Lords and Void Walkers that it'll end up pulling. Yeah. Doesn't clear anything. Next turn is probably uh, Taldoram, one of these cubes. Assuming uh, I get one of them to remain on the board. It's a lot of Doom Guards. It will be. I don't think I want to play the Skull because there's a 50-50 that it just makes me sad. I think we just go. Brawl is just fine here. Like, it gives us two more Doom Guards, um, and then we just gold in. It's looking like a uh, flurry, though, which is going to be a bit of a bummer for our opponent. That's a lot of armor to uh, to just throw into this, and we still get the two Doom Guards back. So this is all but guaranteed, right? We have so many Doom Guards that died. Yeah. I'm lucky on the uh, the Void Caller rolls there, or Void Lord rolls. Void Caller and Void Lord, we missed them both. Like, either would have been better than those Void Walkers, then. Okay. Different Rogue. But, I mean, it's probably safe to assume that it's the same build right cheer 100 hey turtle thank you for those bits appreciate that support as always all right so odd rogue is probably a better matchup right especially if we can get this void lord into play with the void caller um i've got a reasonable swing turn with the uh, the zilliax i just need to not die for a few turns which is a bit of a challenge given that i don't have to file I'm going to tap um, maybe only once. This doesn't really do much for me. I would love a Dark Pact. Or a Defile. Librarian does something. There's that Defile. And it ramps my Spellstone. That was, that was a really good sequence of draws. If he just has a Thug here, we can kill it. Set up the uh, the void caller. This is uh, this is not unwinnable from here. Yeah, I mean we definitely have to kill that, but the good news is like we aren't dying at the moment. Zilliax can swing this back for us. the 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 only bummer is that we don't get the void caller down. Ooh, ooh, you love to see a weak turn from. Ah. Book too soon. I think I like the Zilliax over the Void Caller, just so that I can clear that and uh, like commit his Dagger Charge. The only thing that like ruins that game plan is if he um, if he has SI seven or Skulker. But a lot of times this like this commits his uh, his weapon swing, which is really like healing for. Hmm. Okay. I think I need to get this down. Yeah, it's looking like slamming the Void Caller was the correct line. 
But if we're not dead here, we have a, uh, a reasonable chance. I can play the Void Caller, copy whatever comes out with the Tall Drum. Oh, he's trading. Oh, he's got a Vile Spine in hand. That still would have been really bad if... Uh, For him, if um, if it had pulled the Void Lord. Job done. Don't worry, loves. The cavalry's here. Oh, you know what? Uh, thank you for that heads up, Mike. I um, I posted the wrong list. It would seem. So I'll get that. Uh, I'll get that corrected in a moment. Uh, I have no way to kill this off. So I think I need to tap here. Defile, spell stone, like everything, a lot of things in my deck. Hellfire, uh, kill this off. And I can't live without killing it. That's going to kill it, so perfect. Whew. I think we just got out of here. Yikes. We just saw this card. I'm out of cards. At least this opponent doesn't have sap, right? <laughs> uh, and we just get more two more Void Lords next turn. This is a uh, weaker into like vile spine, so I think making more um, void lords is just correct here. Uh, kill off the pirates and just let him fatigue himself for a while. Like we don't lose from here if we just kill his stuff. Unless he somehow generates a vanish or something stupid like that. Yeah, so there's the second vile spine. Now we're safe to just like shove the uh, the Malganus into play. Just need to kill this off, which facilitates better trades. Play the Malganus. Uh, 20, he's taking two fatigue damage. So we just, uh, again, play it safe. And then win next turn. Did you guys know that uh, darkness rises? It seems our opponent's face has exploded. That's good. 